And there's a long story behind fiberglass shingles because a lot of the old timers know them as composition shingles. Um, basically, they're all the same. Composition shingles, uh, three tab shingles, fiberglass shingles are all the same. Just the binder and fiberglass makes it class A fire resistant. So they've dominated the industry as a shingle. And these are fiberglass shingles right here. And these are a dimensional shingle, it's called a laminate. And the reason it's called a laminate is because it takes two different pieces to make this little piece here and here, and they glue them together to make a laminate. Most of these laminates are anywhere from 190 to 220 per 100 square feet, 220 pounds per 100 square feet. Fairly lightweight roof. All houses since the 1970s are built to carry a six pound load per square foot, so 600 pounds per square. So they used to allow three layers of roofs, 600 pounds. Now they only allow two layers because of the quality of the roof. So it's a fairly lightweight roof, but it's probably the most maintenance free roof in the industry. You could walk on it. Me as a roofer, walking on it, I can see if there's a problem. If they have a leak, I'm gonna see it because this is the roof, it's the waterproofing. The paper underneath it, despite everybody's thoughts, has nothing, nothing at all to do with roofing. If your shingles get wind damage and they're torn, now the paper is becoming the protection, but paper underneath fiberglass shingles have nothing to do with waterproofing. The shingle itself is the waterproofing, which allows me to walk the roof and see, is this roof in good shape, is it waterproof? Because I'm looking at the actual waterproofing. Um, anyway, they're lightweight. The, this shingle itself has 110 mile hour wind resistance. You can get it up to 130 miles an hour by application. Just a couple more nails per shingle. Um, very good, reliable, maintenance free roof. Um, though you should always have, every couple years, somebody get on your roof, clean off the debris. Debris is the death of roofs. It causes damming, causes the water to run differently, mud builds up on there, holds moisture onto the roof longer, and it causes decay of the roofing system. So, you want to make sure your roof stays clean and go ahead and maintenance it anyway, even though this is a maintenance free roof.